Hi, I welcome all of you in this video in which I am going to solve a 2K factorial design. In this problem, we have taken three factors with the name A, B and C. Their levels are 10, 12 for A, 25th and 30 for, level, for factor B and 200, 250 for the factor C. The low level of the factor has been coded as minus 1 and the high level as plus 1. So it become a coded design. If we replace this minus sign for the factor A by 10 and plus sign with the 12, likewise in the factor B minus with the 25 and plus with 30 for the factor C minus with 200 and plus with 250, it will become a uncoded design. Two replications have been performed. So we are going to solve this problem in the mini tab. First of all, go to the stat, then go to DOE, then factorial, create a factorial design. In the create factorial design, we have first option that is two level factorial design default generators. After that, always select the number of factors. We have three factors, then go to the design. In the design, we will have to select either it's a half fraction design, fractional factorial design or a full factorial. We have a full factorial design. Then we have two replications, select the number of replication equal to two and then click OK. After that, go to the factor. Here you will have to give the name of each factor. In the problem, we have names by default A, B and C. So there is nothing to do. However, if you want to change the name, you can change it like this. You can just write it. So we can do editing. Then minus one and plus one because our design in the question is a coded. So leave it is as minus one plus one. However, if you have a uncoded design, then you will have to enter the low and high values. Just like for example, 10 and 12. If I want to enter it, so I will say that 10 as low and 12 as high. Anyhow, so far we have a coded design. So I will write minus one and plus one. Click OK. After that, go to the options. In the option, please uncheck this randomized run. It is very important as I told you in the earlier videos also. Click OK. After that, in the result, nothing you will have to do. Just click OK. After that, press OK and you will get a design based upon 2K factorial. So this was the design and it is a coded design. Information, I have also made a uncoded design in which I have entered the real values of the levels just like 10, 12, 25, 30, 200 and 250. I have to enter the response variable. The name is fill height. Then we go towards the problem. So we see that minus, 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 it is minus three for the first time. So I've written there minus three. And after that, it is plus one, minus, minus. So plus one, minus, minus, it is zero. So zero. In this way, you will have to enter the data for the first replication, the first eight values. It will end up here plus 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 and the value is six. So plus 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 and the value becomes six. And then for this again, minus minus minus, the second replication will get started and you will have to enter the data as minus one. In this way, the data will be entered. I have entered the data for the uncoded design and to save the time, I will just copy and paste this data to the coded design factor. So I will click on this whole data and it'll say delete it. And after deleting, I will paste the new one. So in this way, in the next video, I will go to analyze the data. Thanks for watching this part. Bye.